Electronic visit verification, which is also known as EVV, will help you improve your reimbursement process and improve your accuracy for submitting billing and payroll. Having the right technology in place is the best way to stay ahead of meeting the requirements that is set by the 21st Century Cures Act. So within generations, we are under the EVV schedules area, and you will be able to streamline your scheduling by receiving many different alerts. For example, you will have a missed visit alert. So that would be when a caregiver doesn't clock in at the right time of their shift, you can be alerted. And then also there is a task alert, which would alert you if a caregiver has not completed any type of required tasks when clocking out of their scheduled visit. And then there is also something called wellness alerts, which where you can monitor changing client conditions by those wellness alerts. So from this area, you can easily see the schedules for today's date. You'll be able to see the client's name, caregiver, the schedule start, schedule end, and also the real-time log in and log out would be shown down here as well. And then if your caregivers are successfully clocking in and out at the right location and also the right time, your shifts will automatically confirm for you. So for in this example, you can see that the shift automatically confirmed and then it was actual GPS. So that means that this caregiver has clocked in within the GPS variance that was set up. You can also click on this pencil icon to edit the schedule if needed as well. This is where you can also see the scheduled tasks that have been assigned, and you can also see what ones have been completed or not completed. Also from this area are the wellness questions and the answers that the caregiver has submitted. And then also over here, there are exceptions. So exceptions um, could be added when a caregiver forgets to clock in or clock out, or maybe they're having any type of tech. You might have to put in a manual clock in or a manual clock out, put an exception and put a reasoning as to why you, you did so. So that's a look of Generations EVV. Thank you.